Hi guys, uh, today I'm just doing a brief video on some of the nail varnishes I've got at the moment. I've got quite a few, as you can see from this. Um, but I'm just gonna like say what they are, um, so on, so forth. Um, I've got this on at the moment. It's a metallic blue green kind of colour. Um, it's by Miss Sporty. Um, doesn't really say a name. I don't think Miss Sporty do, but it's number twenty three. Um, so yeah, in the lasting colours selection. I also have this metallic blue, which is from Avon. Um, also, it's called Cosmic Blue. I thought it didn't have a name, but it does. That's from Avon. I got that for my birthday. Uh, I've got this really dark purple. Goes in my lipstick. Um, that's called Black Cherries by Rimmel London. Um, uh, da, da, da. Collection 2000. Another purple. I like purple. As you can tell by my wall, purple is my favourite colour. Um, what's this called? Teeny Bikini Purple. Um, Becca got me this for my birthday or Christmas. Birthday or Christmas. Could be Christmas. Um, she gets me so well. She knows my favourite colour and whatnot. So, Becca, if you're watching this, thank you. Um, I have this, it's hard to tell but that's like a purpley browny metallic colour, um, it's glittery, that's by W7, uh, it's called Metallic Mercury, I've never really seen one like this before, it's really nice, it's hard to tell on camera what it's like, is that a bit clear, no not really, um, I have another W7 pink metallic kind of colour that is called doo -doo -doo. Marvel Crack. I don't know why. It's quite a cool one. It's a crackle effect one, but it doesn't work particularly well. But it's nice just on its own. Uh, da -da -da. I have a little silver one. That is by Seventeen. It doesn't have a name on it because I got it in a big set. I uh, have another Rimmel London one. A greeny bluey kind of colour. It's hard to tell on camera what colour it is but that's actually a green. Um, that is Sky High. And that's got a flat brush of it. It's Express flat brush. Apparently that's quicker to do your nails with, but I, I don't know. Uh, one second application. I don't know, I think it takes me longer than that because I kind of double layer it to make it a lot more thick. You see like this. More of a strong colour. Uh, I like a pinky red kind of colour by 17. That came in my set. Uh, I had this funny colour change in pink it's like a, a glittery kind of pink and um, that's by Avon um, it's rose quartz um, that's pretty cool you know I normally put it on top of stuff like if I have a matte colour and then I put a glittery coat on top of it because it's not very bright on its own um, have another pinky metallic kind of colour by Rimmel London again. Uh, that's called Euphoria. That's quite nice. A bit different. One got me that for my birthday. Um, another glittery purple. I got to love my purple. Um, that's number 17. That's also out of my set. So, got three so far. 
I got quite a few. I'm not sure how many it had in. Like, it was quite a big set, but it was, you know, quite cool. Um, a plain black one by MUA. Um, I don't think that has a name on it. It's number fifty. It's it's just plain black, so I suppose I don't really need to name it. <laughs> Another purple. <laughs> This is like my fourth purple. I am actually addicted. And funnily enough, this is called Purple Addict by uh, Rimmel. This is a pro one. Uh, it's got a maxi brush, which is mistake free application. Although you can still make mistakes because they're pretty wide. And if you have little fingernails like this, and you go like that, and it's just going to go all over the edge of your fingers. But you know. <laughs> And then I have this undercoat for my crackle, uh, limited edition crackle. This was actually called Black Earthquake by W7. Mm. I'm trying to look for ones that aren't too shabby. <laughs> I have a barrier, my netting nail varnish that Becca also bought me. I think that, I'm pretty sure that was for my birthday um, because that's most recent and that is, I don't think it's got a name on it. <laughs> oh it has but I can't really see it. Magnetic Burgundy. So that is a beautiful colour and it comes out in like a stripy pattern. Um, I might do a tutorial on that although it's really basic it just looks really cool. And when I first got it, I was a bit confused as to how to use it. Because it's got like a little magnet on the top. And I was like, what do I do? And yeah, I'll, I'll do a tutorial one day. Because it's dead simple. <laughs> got another black by Rimmel London. Um, that's Black Cab. Uh, nothing special about that one really. Got to have my basic blacks and my, you know, purples going on. <laughs> have another Barry M which is a very light blue very pale blue absolutely beautiful although it does tend to stay in nails I find that Barry M does then like stay in nails so although it's a very good brand I wouldn't go for it myself because it costs an absolute bomb and it just stains nails so what's the point <laughs> and that's called blueberry which is really cute <laughs> What else have I got in here? Stay Perfect number 7. I love number 7. They are well worth buying. This is totally teal. It's beautiful. It's like a, a greeny, bluey kind of colour. I really like it. Um, yeah, I wear that quite a lot. It's kind of like this, but like less shiny. <laughs> very light pink very very light and <laughs> um, that's also out of my 17 collection maybe I had 17 in it I never really thought of it like that but maybe <laughs> then I have a stargazer which um, my boyfriend's sister gave to me but I've seen these in Rolfers there's one in Hanley. Um doesn't say what colour it is, but it is the same colour as the one I'm wearing. I have about three that are the same colour because I absolutely like the colour. And people seem to give me them. <laughs> so I don't disagree, to be honest. Um and then I have another purple by number seven, stay perfect. I think this was another set and it was really good. But I'm running a bit low now, so I need to get some more. Um, that's Temptress. That's beautiful. Then I got some glitter, some nice pink glitter. Um, another pink glittery one by Number Seven. That's the Stay Perfect collection. The name is actually rubbed off, so I don't know what it's called. Gains with an M. But that's all I know, sorry. <laughs> if I find out I'll like write it in the bottom bit or something, I 
I don't know. I'll tell you on my next video. So you have to keep watching. Or something like that. Uh, what else have I got? Wow, that's big. <laughs> that is like a pink by number seven. It's another Stay Perfect, but this isn't out of the set because, as you can see, it's a lot bigger. <laughs> um, that's Pink Grapefruit, number 80. That is really cute. Kind of the same colour as my top. Uh, well. I actually, considering I'm not a very girly person, I have quite a few pinks. I think pinks are just a basic nail varnish colour that most people have. Like I have this really light pink out of my number 17 collection. I have this Barbie pink, which I love. I love Barbie pink like this. Because I wear like a really grungy outfit. Or like a really butch outfit. And then I wear Barbie pink nail varnish. And it just, it looks so funny. People are like what is she wearing they're like they're like oh she's such a musher oh uh, they're like say what she got pink nail varnish on i'm like mm-hmm i roll like that so yeah <laughs> what else have i got in my magic bag oh malibu I love the drink Malibu. This is from the Cocktail Collection by Nail Inc. Um, I don't have many of these nail varnishes because they're quite expensive as far as I'm aware. I was given this as a gift. As the <laughs> and this is Malibu Mahuta. And it's really nice. Another <clears throat> like green kind of colour. Uh, another nail ink I told you I don't have very many I don't know where I got this one from that's no, called Pill Piccadilly Citrus Piccadilly Citrus this is Piccadilly Citrus I do know um, it's pretty pretty like ready blood coloured quite nice you know like if you're going on a night out and you're just wearing black or something you just wear a bit of red in your nails like, that's what I like to do <laughs> um, this is actually a brown out of my number 17 collection I kind of like brown nails for some reason I think it looks a bit different a bit abstract it adds a bit to you you know gives you a bit of volume and whatnot um, then I have my basic whites, this is NYC, New York colour, uh, long wear, nail and animal, French white. I use these in tutorials if anyone's wondering. I don't tend to nail my nail, nail, name my nail varnishes in tutorials because I don't think it's about the brand. I just use whichever one is handy, whichever one suits the tutorial I'm doing. But um, I know most people do. <laughs> This is Magnolia Pearl by Rimmel London. It's like a whitey pink um, shiny colour. I usually use it as some type of top coat to give the colour a bit of depth. I think it's really quite pretty. It's just light and you know different. Um, then I've got a French manicure um, bottom layer which is just like kind of a skin colour. Just plain. <laughs> Then I have Collection 2000, purple, light purple, um, number 18, um, BMX Bandit, it's pretty cool. I got those, I think I got these ones like on offer for like 3 for 5 quid or something a while back, but I don't use them that much so they're pretty good still. Um, the rest are pretty shabby. This is just a ready pink colour out of my 17 collection. Um, but I think I'm going to leave it at that because you're probably sick to death of looking at my nail varnishes by now. Um, so yeah, I keep saying I'm going to do tutorials and honestly I am going to. Um, I've been busy with other stuff like today. 
I've lost my memory stick for college. So I've been having a bit of trauma. So you have to be patient with me guys. Um I'll do that video as soon as possible. There will be some more videos up soon of other things, you know, gigs and stuff, so you know what I'm like. Um so I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it gave you a bit of inspiration. Thank you for watching.